Hey everybody, it's your girl Bev and I'm back with another planner related video. If this is your first time here, welcome to my channel. Please hit that subscribe button and the notification bell. That way, anytime I post a video, you'll know. So guys, I know y'all see it. <laughs> if you've been watching my videos, you'll see that I bought the Glam Girl Planner on last Thursday from Auntie Joanne's. And a few other little things. So see how pretty she is. These the homebody sticky notes. The Glam Girl sticky notes. However, I will not be using her until the new year. She is tucked away back here. So I just put all my other stuff in here to make me feel like I'm using her. So... With that being said, this is last week. I didn't fill in here. I was using my personal planner. That's the type of week I was having. Didn't do date night. That's okay, though. Everything else written down did happen. So, this is the new week. This is the new week. Um, I want to use my homebody sticker book. Let me give a quick little cute flip because it has the green accents in it and wrong, wrong, wrong is a green for the month of October. With that being said, I'm just, you know, so with that being said, I'm just going to go ahead and let my juices flow. Mm -mm -mm. No, I'm kidding. I'm in a good mood, so I hope you are too. I'm definitely loving this sticker book. Everything about it. It is super cute. I love it. Look, look at how the flowers. You see that? It looks like a sticky note almost. That is super awesome. Super duper awesome. See, look how pretty that is. I'm going to put another one on, which one should I use? This one on the other side. I'm trying to match it up, though. You know, these are made for the dashboard layout, but we're going to use them over here on the vertical because that's, I'm a vertical girl. You know, I'm coming up, well... I'm coming up on a year on YouTube. However, I made a year in the planner community on in August, the end of August. So I don't quite remember the exact exact day, but yeah, your girl been bopping for a year now, or should I say, 14 months? That's a little crooked, but we gonna live with it. There's certain things you just gotta live with, you know. Yeah, so, you know, um, I finally know who I am when it comes to planners, like the layout and stuff, like what layout I prefer and I work well in, and it is vertical. Without a shadow of a doubt, it's vertical. So, you know. That's good, because once once you know who you are as a planner, everything else just falls into place, literally. Like, you know. Now, the Glam Girl is vertical lined. It's a difference because it doesn't have these lines. It just goes straight down, but it is vertical. But the reason why I said I could use it is because... um. When I write, you know, when it's a plain box, you tend to like slant or what have you, and your words are not always straight. So I said, let me try to use the um vertical and see if that's something. The vertical line, excuse me, that's something that I can do, can enjoy. I'm going to pull these out because 
I want to plan properly. I don't want any restrictions on the planning. Okay. Where's homegirl tweezer? I need her right quick. Okay. So let me know down below what's your planning style. Do you like vertical, horizontal, dashboard, uh, hourly, Buju, boo, I say Buju guys, like, you know, but it's Bujo, if you like Bujo, and um, let me know. I think I'm going to move that sticker so I can put some of these under there. These are so cute. It looked like the window hanging from the window ledge. That's the look I'm going for anyway. I hope it lets me. Ooh, I'm unripped it. Look at the way. We're going to have to do sticker surgery. Because I done ripped the sticker. But that is okay. Ooh, child. I'm living dangerously. Got it. <clears throat> Yay me. So I'll place you down here instead. Yeah, yeah. Can't really tell it ripped. And that's okay. So I'm gonna put this on the hair. And everything like that. Okay. Sorry guys, my son's taking out the trash. You know, life has to be done sometime, you know. So, yeah, so that's cute so far. I love that. Okay. Put your heart into it. Yes, you do have to put your heart into everything that you do. Buy less and choose well. I need this on my planner. Because your girl got a spending problem, okay? And she needs to chill out and get on her budget. Stay on budget, I should say. Because I don't stay on budget. Right, so... Okay, now. Ooh, pretty. Let me put one of these down. I, lo I love this homebody. Oh my goodness. Like, I'm having a moment, y'all. Because I love homebody en enough to duplicate it. I don't like how this is. Like, buy another copy of it. I have the classic and the vertical, the classic and the vertical, the classic and the mini of, of it, but like I will buy another classic and another mini. That's how much I like how this looks. Come on, sticker. Some time to give you a hard way to go. But anywho, you know. We gotta get these videos out. Okay, sticker? It look like it's crooked, but it's not. Cause it's right on the line. I'm not understanding why it look crooked then. But anyway. Yeah, guys, I'm, I'm glad that I, back on topic, <laughs> know my, my planning style. Because when, like, top of the year, when they was talking about planning style and learning your planning style and knowing your planning style, I'm like, what? <laughs> I'm just going to buy the planner and use the planner. Now, don't get me wrong. I'm able to use 
any planner, and I'm pretty sure we all are to some degree. But, you know, people that, that's not planners, they don't understand. It's like, just use this one or whatever. <clears throat> You're able to get your plans written down in there. Yes, you are. But... You're not able to, it won't function for you because of the design and the way it flows in your planner. And it'll make you want to, and it'll make you not, you know, refer to your planner and stuff like that. Like, cause I could write the same plans in two different planners and I won't go to that planner. I'll come here. So I'm trying to fix it so that, uh. I'm doing better, you know, using, embra I embraced my planning style. Now I want to make sure that I'm using my tools that I purchase effectively. Because, you know, we tend to buy all the things and want all the things. And that's absolutely okay. You know, you buy what you want and do what you want with your money. But you also want to be able to use the things that you buy. I mean, I know I do. So, it's important that, you know, we remember that. And, you know, we use the stuff that we bought. You no? Know? Yeah? Okay. And, um... Overall, and also like the different planners that's out. I can't put this here. The different planners that's out there. Um, like I'm saying, Happy Planner, Erin Condren, and stuff. You know, the TN, the ring bell plan is A5, A6, B6, whatever your, your, your zhuzh is. Now, I know that I like all of the things. Meaning, I like all of the planners. I don't care what it is. If it's pretty, I want it. That's how my mind works. But, I can't... Stay in them other planners like the ring bound and the, oops, the ring bound and the uh, T ends very long because I function better in the happy planner. It just works for me. I keep going back to it. I can't explain, and so I'm like, well. Then this is what I want. This is the planner for me. You know, sometimes you just have to realize that, you know, you like what you like and that's okay. So, I'm just, you know, going to, this is my second year in the community. And I want to spend it on making quality decisions and expanding my brand you know my shop my youtube channel and stuff like that i have two shops one is an etsy shop and one is a standalone shop and they're both called she love planners she loves with an s planners so, that's my focus on getting it done, if that makes sense. And, you know, doing what's good for me, for my brand, and, you know, listening to what God uh, has for me and what he says to me and to me, for me to do. You know, so that's the goal. I have to find my um my word for 
um, 2020. You know, each last year, I'm new to the community, but I learned that everybody picks their word of the year. And that's who they focus to be. Like last, this year, my word was consistency. And I've been pretty good being consistent, you know, at the things I had to do. Now, the pace and the timing of things <laughs> is a question, but for the, for the most part, I was very, I am very consistent. So, I'm proud of myself for that. And I just want to keep going in that way and focusing on the good. When I picked that when I picked out uh, my planners for 2020, I knew I wanted homebody just for the simple fact that I am a homebody. But I had no idea how uh, much this planner would agree with me like hello somebody like really this planner well the sticker book is um very much my style it's not too flowery you know it's just right i love it i absolutely love this sticker book I have the glam girl because self care excuse me guys <clears throat> self care will be it's, it's, it's on the list to be maybe my word even though it's two words but my word for 2020 but I have to make sure, you know, you have to ponder on it a bit. You can't really just jump out and make that type of decision. So, I just want to make sure that I love it enough to, yeah, that's going to be it, etc. Right? So... And put this flower here to cover up these coins. Even though I don't really cover it up, but it satisfi satisfies me. <laughs> oh boy. Yeah, so enjoying things, getting joy out of stuff, not sweating the small stuff. Um,. And just worrying less. I'm not going to use this sticker today, though. But, yes, you know. Worry less, pray more, stay on task to what? Remain kind. Don't let anybody change me by their behaviors. And stuff like that. So, you know. I think this spread is finished. I thought I wanted to put something here. And I did. It was the routine sticker. So let me go and look for that before I um, end this plan with me. Um, hmm. They got to be coming up because I used stickers that was on that page. I love this book. Everything about it. Here you go. The routine. Now what color do I want? I think I'm going to take this one and put it right on top of here. When I saw this sticker book, this was the words, the routine that I saw that I was like, I got to have that book just from seeing these right here. And, you know, it jumped out at me. A sticker book has never jumped out at me like that before. So I know I'm evolving and growing as a planner and everything so yes this is the completed spread 
what you guys think tell me what you think and don't forget to comment below whether you what type of style you use dashboard vertical horizontal horizontal hourly bujo etc so please go ahead and give my video a big thumbs up again my name is beverly and the channel is she loves planners and i'll be seeing you guys again soon bye